from just running at them at this point outside of like having to commit roar or you know going for something like an imprisonment and t Shorg actually bardo so he's going to be coming to see if he can make something happen to help out and potentially see if they can kill off misery um it's not actually that hard to imagine as the snowball comes through and they are going to be able to maybe find him yeah that's the right click and first blood going the way of the tusk just a little bit far forward um, but regardless, not the biggest deal in the world. This could be if they catch Moo up in the top lane, right clicks, as well as the ground pound, and two kills going off on both sides of the map. Boy, that's what I get for hero icons on the map, huh? That, that would have been such a great rotation, too. Oh, we. Lee is dropping low. Sunstrike might kill off Tavo. They do manage to find that one and trying to get the body blocks in. Aren't going to be able to run away. Salve is going to be there to keep alive the Lycan and the, ch the damage continues as Lu tries to find him here. They haven't been able to hem him in there. Look oh. at the trees. Oh, they're going to be able to control him and that's going to be a kill. Misery takes revenge. Jeez, you can the slow for Misery, but not going to get in range, as you mentioned. And so, because of that, they are going to back up. Do you manage to kill off the boar? Oh my god, is he diving? Dive, Dive deep? deep. Uh, no. Yeah, he's going to go down. That's a quick and easy one. Oh, yeah. That's, uh... <laughs> but he's going to wrap around, and it doesn't look like Tavo is going to realize that this is happening. He does have the eagle on out, and there's going to be the poison touchdown as well as the void. There's going to be the sun strike as well, and that should be enough for a kill running. Yeah, that's going to be enough. I love, well played. I love how Sasuke was body blocking. I want to bring it up the court is going to determine which of these teams comes out ahead. Oh. Rotating in this, down the bottom line. Up top as well, they're jumping and they might be able to kill off Moo. It does look like they're going to be able to finish off the Beastmaster, but at the same time, the right clicks are there. Can they kill off Carlin? They do have the Nature Prophet's Tree there. He gets the kill before he goes down. A pretty nice one. That would have been a really clean escape had they been able to make that work. But Especially if Witch Doctor joined. Oh, and it looks oh. like back towards there, they're going to be able to find him. A quick and easy pickoff as I think Moo is going to end up going down. Oh my god. Yeah, say he's Eclipse getting dropped, that's going to be a problem. Um, Break a force in base, you know what I mean? You don't need that much force. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, let's see. Five to five is the current score, as they are going to be able to jump here, looking for something, as they do have Tavo in the area. The Forge Spirits are going to be able to do a decent chunk of damage, but with the rotations back in, they might have overstepped their bounds, are going to be able to get the silence on its Tavo. He is not going to be able to roar, and that's going to be the snowball save. He's going to be able to come out of this and roar if he wants to, and they're going to look for it. Does manage to commit that onto resolution. They find the kill, but they are going to be able to kill off Rezo, and as the chase continues off to the side, it looks like Moo might be able to go down as well. Can they find that kill? The right clicks are not going to be there and instead they kill off the Ursa. Carlin goes down, so a two sort of out economy them. Uh, uh, the wolf is scouting out this Ursa uh, on as well, so... Uh, and now he knows oh. because he just got hit by the nature stop, but oh, it's too late. Oh, God. All right, Dazzle ends up killing the Ursa. They are going to be able to catch Moo in the top lane, and he does end up falling there to the mixture of the Walrus Punch and everything else, but Misery might just think he's solo and here. They're going to bring on in Resolution, which should be able to finish it, but this is going to be a lot of levels, a lot of gold, and suddenly in a ton of trouble as well. OD in the mid lane, silenced up, and Suits is going to fall. Oh, my goodness. T-Show is crumbling. Yeah, that Roshan attempt was too aggressive at this point. <laughs> yeah, they've got the silence, they've got the catch, body blocks from a dazzle. Oh, misery! Don't let him go where he wants to go. Sunstrike's gonna come through and oh, nice little damage reduction coming out. Is it gonna be enough to keep him alive? No, they're gonna find the kill. Oh, and again, T Show just being ran through. Yeah, I mean fast with strategies. Right. It'll be interesting to see if Digital Chaos are able to maintain their control for Oh, and Sasuke's going to be controlled. The Witch Doctor Ultimate goes as well as the Roar, but that's a lot to commit for just that Night Stalker. And now the question is, can they actually take a fight after the fact? The Treants, they're continuously pushing it in. They they just can't come and contest. What do you do at this point? They have to wait on high grounds now. Yeah. Right, they, they are losing an Invoker as well, yeah. so they might just be waiting out those items. I, I will say that it does sort of feel like, oh god, and they might actually be able to catch Moo here. The roar from afar, the right clicks are going to be there. Walrus Punch as well as the catch, and that's going to be another kill. So, this is the thing. is I It still is going to be difficult if you're not able to kite out the Sorsa, even with his gold disadvantage. This is the right moment to push, I think. Well, it looks like it's time to go as they have ended up moving up there and just look at how quickly it stops. Weha does end up getting roared for the moment. The stuns are there. He does have a BKB if he wants to drop it. Hasn't ended up using it yet. He is going to end up going down. Excuse me, he doesn't have a BKB. He's already dead. Aegis is down as well. Misery gets chased out and he is going to end up getting Astral. I think that he goes down here. Resolution trying his best to right-click down the OD and he does manage to find the kill. A secondary one is they're not going to be able to catch
catch that sun strike, but I think that the Lycan is just going to be able to run down these heroes. Bardo is going to end up going down, and it looks like with eyes on the prize, they're moving back for these barracks. Buyback by the Tusk, as well as the Glyph committed. And this might be a moment where they need to think about backing out again. Rezo dropping somewhat low. is controlled for the moment by those shards. He's going to end up getting Walrus punched here in just a second. Do they have enough to catch him? Ghost walk away. They didn't end up doing it. The gem is still on the ground. There's going to be the counter initiation with the wolves. They are going to be able to kill off Bardo. Die back. That's all heroes dead. This is a huge problem right now. There's no buybacks. The Only gem the will be saved. No, maybe, maybe saved, but yeah, it's probably GG. And oh my it is. goodness. <laughs> this is the moment. I mean, when you have, what, 2,500 network advantage in 29 minutes? When you do decide to go high ground, it should look like that. Every game that you see where that advantage exists and it doesn't look like that, somebody played wrong. And uh, Digital Chaos showing that they know exactly how to take it. Well, very well played indeed. GG well played as Digital Chaos take game one of this best of three series. Yet again, if you guys feel so inclined, drop us a follow on Twitter at Lyrical Dota at the Wonder Cow. We're going to be back in just a second with game number two. And then later on today, we're going to.